Hey guys, be good burb here. So today we're gonna be doing TDS without any support towers. Now this this sounds completely unhinged to me. Even like I don't even know how I'm gonna do this. Like already I struggle without farm or even without DJ or commander. Without any support towers at all is gonna be crazy. My goal with this is trying to be as cheap and effective as possible. So I went with gold soldier for for early to mid. I brought mortar for some crowd control. I brought Elf Camp for its cost effectivity, with being pretty cheap and having a crap ton of DPS. Accelerator for my light game DPS and uh, mini gunner. Yes, normal mini gunner to help out with some extra DPS in mid game, just in case we need it. I didn't want to bring golding because that's like way too expensive. I wanted to be able to save my money for accelerators, and I'm debating between abandoned city and um, fungi island. I feel like Fungi Island is going to be... Uh, well, no, because we have Elf Camp. I think uh, Ben is going to be good. Because I wanted to bring a unit, because it, units really are very, very good. But military base is way too expensive with its like final upgrade and stuff. And it's not very efficient, but Elf Camp is. And Lord knows I'm not bringing Croc Boss for a minion. The reason is, is because you can easily like catch leaks without specifically being placed for leaks. So I think we're gonna invest into that, like, uh, ASAP, probably. Probably just gonna, um, immediately go for this. Like, already no form, like, as I said, already no form is a big challenge. But also, no DJ or commander is also, like, crazy. But I feel like we have enough DPS. I'm just, like, I'm not worried about Fallen King. Fallen King is, like, the least of my concerns. I'm concerned about mid-game. Like, when I say mid-game, I'm talking, like, the Fallens, the the Necromancer. Oh, shoot. Necromancer. Shoot. Every single time I don't bring farm, that's, like, the biggest problem. Because, like, oh, I have a mortar. I have mortar. I'll be able to deal with it. But, like, mortar, like, level 3 mortar is not cheap. Which is how you counter Necromancer, by the way. But, um, I'm going to get these first before I start worrying about that. If I get snowball elves and then I'll start going for some other stuff. These will help against the quicks, making just just preventing them from leaking. And once we start getting snowballs, once we it's like building those up early is really good. And uh, we'll just go for I don't know this one. It doesn't really matter because it doesn't reset the spawn timer on the other on the, the normal units. So I was gonna look for which one's about to spawn and then press it after it spawns, but like, it doesn't really matter. Do they still have 1.5? Yep, that, that's smaller than I remember, but okay. Now I'm gonna go for the mortar. Uh, mainly, I think heavies right now is the use of the mortar. Cause we could probably just slowly over time kill the boss with just elf camps. But, uh, yeah. Heavy is... I don't want that taking forever. <coughs> I just need a bit more money. Just a bit more. Where's those... Where are the snowballs at? <coughs> there they are. There they are. They're coming. Oh, there's one right there. I didn't even see that one. I'm actually probably going to place this right here. Shoot the auto skip. I'm surprised. I am surprised and glad that I noticed that early. Because that would have screwed me over. Like, that, that would have just ended the run. If I forgot that completely. Gosh, I swear. The only time where auto skip isn't a detriment to me is when I'm speedrunning. I we good to skip here. Because, like, every time else, whenever I'm... Because the only th other time I play this freaking game is when I'm um, doing challenge videos like this. Um, and that, most of the time, means we don't want to be spam skipping. But auto skip just makes you spam skip. That's the whole point of auto skip. Also, we have so many snowballs, and they just died. Alright, we already got a level 2. Uh, that's not good that our snowball elves just died. But we have two more over here. I got the mortar, which will do some decent damage, doing 24. Nice. 
24, some pretty good damage. We have three snowball elves. Just hit your shots, please. All right, good. Another good thing about units is that it lets you know if something's leaking and you don't notice. Because if you if you don't see the unit spawning, then you're screwed. Or you, you, you just have to quickly parkour to the back and try to see what the heck is running by your defenses. Um. Okay, another boss. Uh, if they miss, then they hit the abnormals behind it. Yeah, the Warner's just gonna take out all those abnormals immediately. Okay, yeah, never mind. The abnormals just get bodied as soon as they try and approach the boss, because the mortar just freaking kills the- oh, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Okay. I'm so glad I remember that hidden's worth thing. This soldier isn't do gonna do the best against the hiddens, but it'll do decent. Plus, with the elf camps, we should be fine. But I'll probably get uh, level 3 for the shadows on wave 15. Boom, bigger cannon. That almost sees the entrance. But yeah, that's just going to one-shot anything and everything. And we'll set this to strongest. Usually it's pretty good on strongest. Yeah, the problem with the hiddens is I was just investing all my money into a mortar, which does not have hidden detection. Yeah, that's what, kind of what I was just fearing. Is, but we should just be able to do this and be fine. Just together, these do 30 damage a burst. Right? These are doing three, three, yep, three damage and five burst. Which is 15 each, but... They're being goofy and leave them on 11 for some reason. Don't ask me. Well, no, actually that makes sense. Because they waste damage on the, the final shot. Okay, breakers will be easy because we have mortar. Hard counter to breakers. The mortar's just going to make this so much easier. Mortar is such an underrated tower. get those bombers i really want to get the guardians uh for fallen's mainly because those just take a chunk of their hp away along with the mortar also doing that and so are the bombers um i'm really indecisive right now like i want to work on my elf camps but i also want to get a mini gunner but i also want to work on my soldiers possibly uh that's like a whole thing. Another problem with the mortar trap for breakers is that if you don't have anything to deal with the breaker ones themselves, then you're in a bit of a struggle. Yeah, but we're good. Uh, I'm gonna go for the mini. And we're gonna set this to strongest for right now. Just to do damage to those those that pesky necromancer. Elf camps can deal with those breakers. It's about a summon. Didn't spawn kill those, no. Okay, well, they're dead. And this thing's about to die. Nice. Okay. Alright, yeah. I just got the soldier to level 3 because it's some good DPS. Do I work on a level 4 soldier is the question. Because that's 120 damage a burst, which is crazy. We have more Fallens this wave. Um, I'm a little bit worried about those Fallens. The Mortar's going to do good overtime damage. I'm going to set this back to first so it doesn't target some abnormal- No, set it to first! Why? It's not letting me change the freaking targeting. Did you guys see that? That was goofy. No, that, 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 that was goofy. Goofy, ah. Uh, we should be good on the boss. I do the, 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 the giant boss. We should be good on that. I'm just going to save it for a level four soldier. Because that's going to shred the fallen zone with 23 and 24 and 25. 
Gosh, the phones are relentless after after this wave. Like, you get a break from them for one wave, then they have to start up each and every one of the next waves. Just fallens, fallens, fallens. I just have to hope it doesn't auto-skip before, uh, like, the wave timer doesn't run out before we kill this, because if so, we are dead. Already doing pretty decent damage. The 55 extra damage every now and then is pretty good. Guardian Elves would be good for this boss, but oh, we're also building up some snowballs, which are more accurate because this is a slow, slower enemy. Yeah, shoot, 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 we're running out of time. Uh oh. Okay, quickly take it down. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. We are good. We are good. We are good. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We are fine. We are chillin'. We are mad, mad chillin'. That necromancer. Uh -oh. I wish. I mean, we have the soldier. Uh, it's about to kill all those skeletons. Yep. It's the mortar just shreds those. Oh, shoot. Wait. Uh. This one's about to spawn, so we should wait for that to spawn. Don't want to reset the timer, like, uh, on the main one, I guess. I don't know, maybe the, the, the main one should be the last of our concerns right now. This wave gives you gives you way more time to deal with the giant boss, so it's, like, really good for us. Uh, Shadow Boss. Oh, shoot. Shadow Boss. Oh, shoot. Shadow Boss. Well, I mean, we should have Guardian Elves incoming. Yeah, those have 60 HP, which is just a nice ch chunk of their HP each gun. Do they have, like, if they, if they, can they hit the Shadow Boss if they're targeting something behind the Shadow Boss? That's my question. Okay, we'll wait for that to spawn. Uh, I guess we'll also wait for the other one to spawn, I guess. Um, we should be gun glitches, I hope. This wave has- oh, shoot, oh, shoot. Good, strongest, 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 strongest. Kill those necromancers now. That's- that's gonna be a lot. Oh, shoot. Kill all those. They killed most of them. That was loud. I hope that wasn't too loud in the video. I hope I didn't just, like, ear rape you guys. Okay, we've reduced them to three. The um, mortar slowly weakening them. Okay, two, two, two. Two is good, two is good. Gosh, whoever thought wave 25 would be a problem. Actually, wave 25's been a problem several times. And we are good. Let's get that level three minigunner up and going. I should probably start investing into an accelerator like, before tank. Okay, glitches. Yo, glitches. Chill. 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 Bro, yo, chill. Bro, chill. That was crazy. No, that, that, that is crazy. Okay, this should be able to deal with these glitches. Or at least weaken them. Okay, please. Chill, bro. Okay, we're good, we're good. We're good. We are fine. Okay. We are somehow still alive. What are you doing? What the hell, bro? Oh my goodness. What is going on here? Guys, hazards. Why are hazards existing? Like, guys, you can't let hazards exist. It's against the law for hazards to exist. It's literally illegal. Hazards are illegal. Petition to make hazards illegal. 
the singular. That, that's the one that that tanks the glitches. The single um freaking gunner or cannon air. Like as soon as this can reach these boys, yeah, they're dead. Dude. I'm not gonna be able to get a max level accelerator by not by tank. Like there is no way. Hopefully, uh, we should be good with just with just these two. 30k accelerators. Right. Oh. oh shoot, oh shoot. That's a lot of fallens. Bro, why is wave this challenge just makes every single wave a problem? Okay, so, uh, 21k more is not great. Oh, wait, shoot, 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 um, let's let these spawn. Max, what wave are you on? 30. Oh. Okay. Okay, um... I think we're dead. Like, I think we're dead. Uh, yo, bro, like... Like, um... Like, bro, like, they like, target the tank, bro. Yo, bro, 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 watch out, jet. Like, nah, we dead. Uh, I don't even know why I'm trying anymore. We're dead. Well, this was a good try. Uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna go with this, because we did. Um, yeah, that was a good run. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, this was not the smartest idea for a challenge, but I, I think Wave 31, that's pretty good. That the Wave 31 is not half bad for not having farm, DJ, commander, or anything like that. Uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Yeah. Be good. Burp out.